and we're back. We got a good old garden asada going. Look at that meat. Little hot links. Two of them just to snack on. Look at that. Garden asada right now. The jalapenos, the onions. It's a must right here. I'll show you. Look at that. Thank you to uh, my mother-in-law for sponsoring this video. From coming up, we had a party yesterday. There's all the leftover meat. And we're gonna grub it up. All right guys, so we let this meat chill for a little bit, grill up on that side, and then we put it right here. And we let it just chillax, relax, let the fat break down and render down. And look at that meat right there. We got this one on the hot side, letting that cook up, sear up, maybe about two minutes on each side, then put it right here, and then on with the other meats. Let's get it done. Got the jalapenos right there, look at that. Onions, letting this side smoke. Got another piece of meat right there. Mesquite briquettes and mesquite lump right here, giving that good smoky flavor. On the cheddar as usual. And the reason why I do this, just let it sear this meat. Let it get that flavor. And then what you want to do is, you know, let it smoke for maybe about 10 minutes, 15 minutes. And then the steak comes out like juicy, man. A little juicy. We got the asada right here. We got the ghetto uh, heating pan with some, uh, add some ribs left over. Goddamn shadow. The meat right here. I'm just, you know, 
turning them. There's a heating tray I'm gonna put the meat in. Letting those things warm up. I'm ready to grab soon. So we're all done here. We got my plate, some meat, tortillas, rice and beans. Hopefully you guys you had a good uh, Labor Day weekend. Here's the end of it. Tomorrow we go back to work and do it all over again till the next weekend. To everybody out there, thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. Peace out, guys.